Previously on Minecraft Story Mode. Heroes can come from unlikely beginnings. And broken friendships can lead to dark rivalry. When the world is in danger, fate calls on the ordinary to do extraordinary things. And go on journeys they had only dreamed of. Our heroes, thrown together by fate, must now seek help from a legendary artisan of chaos. But the question remains, will it be enough to save the world? Jesse, you're not even having a little fun? I mean, I am! I mean, sure the world's in danger, but this is our chance to be heroes. Just don't lose track of why we're here, okay? If we don't get the order back together, the Witherstorm is going to eat everything. That means we need to get to Magnus as soon as freaking possible. You know what? You're right. We're gonna find Magnus, bring him back, and he'll totally know how to blow that thing sky high. Uh, dude! <laughs> oh! Ow, 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 ow! Hide! Ah! Why does it hate us so much? The mine carts! Hurry! Use something on that gas! Okay, think fast, Jesse. What to choose? Just, um, uh, don't miss, okay? I don't want it to hate us even more. Time to move, buddy. Let's go. You were awesome, Jesse. With that gas and chasing the minecart, that is like the perfect warm up for when we get to Boomtown. Boomtown? Yeah! Boomtown! This is it. I liked it when you went first last time. Maybe you should take this one again. Yeah. Whoa! 
You see that? Utter chaos, man. Wow, a cactus. You don't see these back home. I take it as a souvenir, but I don't want to stick it in my pants. Good call, buddy. Do all these belong to different griefers? really fresh. Smells fresh, too. The graphic design for some of these is questionable at best. Yeesh. It's freaking glow. Glowing. Yeah, well, the green part is. That's weird. Yeah. And look, it glows brighter when I move it in certain directions. Easy does it. Easy. Maybe to the left. No, the right. I mean, your left. Right, I mean. Your right. About left. Axel? You're stressing me out with that. Whoa. Whoa! Ding, ding, ding! Looks like that spire is where we'll find Magnus. Hey there, new people. You, uh, you said you know where Magnus is? All the griefers here in Boomtown want to find Magnus, you know. Why do you want to know so badly? Oh, no reason. What's going on? Nor found some noobs with a thingy that can find Magnus. Jesse? <laughs> Bunch of scavengers. This drop is mine. You better keep away from us or I'll make you hurt in places you didn't even know existed. <gasps> Get back here with that. I need that thing. Come back. Oh, mighty Magnus, I have for you this offering. <laughs> no! <laughs> Bunch of noobs. They go in the same way? They're working together. This is just how we do it in Boomtown. Which one took the amulet? I'll get the one with the fishing pole, you get the little blue-haired creep. Think fast! Whoa! Your training is coming along nicely, Newt. Just give me the amulet. Jeez, pal. No need to shout. Here, a reasonable conversation! Whoa. My turn! <laughs> hey, did Nor come this way? Yeah, and she had the amulet again. Stop right there! How about... no? <laughs> ah! These bricks will take forever to punch through. Luckily, I think I found us a punch-free entrance. Sorry guys, but I've been trying to find Magnus for way too long for you to stop me now. Oh, bad. Jesse, look out! Way too close. You know what you remind me of? This song I had stuck in my head once. I just couldn't get it to go away. Yeah, oh, man. 
<sighs> okay, little amulet. Show me the way. Of course, not sure what I'll do when I get there, but that I... Ah! Give it back! It's more important than you know! Uh-oh! Again? Nice! What did I tell you about teamwork? What? But I'm the one who said we should work together! We did- Got it! I actually got it! Quick! Flush him out! Magnus is somewhere in that building above us. He's got to be close. Then quick, toss me the amulet. You're surrounded by griefers and they're going to tear you apart. Well, Jesse, we need to move now. Just don't lose it. Hey, don't worry about me. I got this. You just keep them distracted. At the top! Yeah, that's where I saw it! Love a good table turn. Excellent. Oh no, you don't! Get back here! Well, hello, opportunity. Jesse, you made it. You don't need to sound so surprised. Do you have the amulet? Of course. Me and the pig, we totally rocked it. Well, I'm glad everyone's safe. Good boy, Reuben. Magnus, here we come. Huh, maybe it's... I don't know, locked or something. That's a thing people do to important doors, right? Fine. Knocking worked, for once. So it seems. Let's get in there. Right behind you. You are completely surrounded by hundreds of hidden death traps. One step closer, and kaboom! It's Magnus! We totally got caught by Magnus! Uh, oh. I think we're gonna die now. Did you really think you could sneak up on me? Ha! You're two of the worst griefers I've ever met. And a pig? Really? Hardly stealthy. Hey, no griefers here. <laughs> no way. We came from way out of town to find you. Oh, really? I mean, that guy? He's got griefer written all over him. Man, you don't know how much that means to me. Yeah, well, that's because he's your biggest fan. Look at him. I mean, not like biggest fan. Right? So tell me something, not griefers. How'd you find me? You working with someone? Or maybe you bribed another griefer? Gabriel sent us on this mission. Gabriel? <laughs> You're seriously telling me you're buddy-buddy with Gabriel? You know how often people try and tell me that one. This is all sounding pretty weird, dudes. Ah! Who are you really? Why are you here? 
I want answers. Now. The world is being destroyed. You have me intrigued. Go on. There's a huge monster eating up the entire world, and nothing can stop it. That's why Gabriel told us to reunite the Order. Magnus, you've got to come with us. You might be the only chance we have. Give me one reason ah! why, for even a second, I should come with you. I am the ruler of this place. I keep the disorder! Ugh, you know what? Forget it. Just go get Eligard instead. I bet she wouldn't say no to all the honor and glory. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Let's not get too hasty. Just look at it from my perspective for a minute. All this stuff you've told me, you expect me to just take your word for it? Two strangers with wild stories and nothing to show for it. Magnus, every word of what I'm saying is true. You have to believe me. Okay, okay, you sold me. I'm in. might have a little bit of a problem getting out of here. <laughs> huh? You're Magnus. You can just walk out of here. Hello? I don't know if you've looked around this place, but uh, it's kind of full of griefers. But that's kind of awesome, right? <laughs> no. You've heard about the whole challenging the king for his crown thing, right? It's like their thing. So long as I'm king... I can't leave this tower. I know how you feel. No, you don't. But you're Magnus. No one can beat you. And that's the problem. Simply put, that's life as king of Boomtown. <laughs> Not as fun as you'd think. I mean, hey, I do get to spit on their heads occasionally, so I guess that's them. But couldn't you just let them win? I've beaten them dozens of times. No one would believe it. But you, huh, you're the newcomer with the gold amulet. By now, there'll probably be all sorts of rumors about how awesome you are. If you beat me, then I'll be able to leave. Can't believe I didn't think of it before. How would I ever beat you? <laughs> I know, right? But that's just it. You won't have to. Oh, this is gonna be good. I'm actually excited about this. But we gotta make sure it looks legit. The Death Bull has never seen the carnage that we're about to create. Uh, what's the Death Bull? This is the Death Bull! I love Gentle Griefers to the Death Bowl! In one corner we have Magnus, your King of Boomtown! Prepared to defend his title and crown! So tiny, welcome to the Death Bowl. The Grief Off to end all Grief Offs. How do you want to fake this? How are we going to fool him? What's your, uh, grand plan? We'll start off small, then I'll throw some TNT at you. Just let it graze you, and then we'll call it a finish, all right? Okay, something about TNT. Awesome! And you, what name do you go by? I'm gonna need a name. I am Jesse the Destroyer, and I am here to destroy my competition. You heard the name, folks. Give a big death ball welcome to... The Destroyer! Then let's begin! Opponents will craft their own griefing towers, which they will then use to grief each other. The only rule but is... there are no rules! No eye poking! Other than that, go crazy! Seriously. Oh! Destroyer! Pick your building material, and Magnus, you... Nah, I'm good. Brought my own supply. Let the griefing begin! Wood? 
some stone, some hmm, pink wool. Stone it is. Hmm, not bad. Not bad. Guess it'll have to do. Axel, what are you doing over there on his side? Yeah, thought you might bring that up. It's just that Reuben wanted to take your corner, and I didn't want to crowd him or anything, so I thought I'd, um, watch from over here. Take your best shot! And that's how you shouldn't throw an egg. Ha! You grief with me, you grief with the best! I'm about to destroy you, Destroyer. Is that what they call ironic? Luckily, you won't destroy me, so we won't have to find out. You are but a student. Prepare yourself, for I am here to give you your final lesson. Ha! That was just a warning! What? A warning that you need glasses? It seems the student has become the master, and the mighty destroyer will win the day. I don't know what that means, but I love it and want to put it on a t-shirt! to getting hit by my TNT. Nobody messes with the Boom Master! Uh-oh. Jesse! Jesse, you okay? Had enough yet? Alrighty! I think noob time is over. What part of throwing the fight was that? What say you, noob? I am king! And those who challenge me will be annihilated! Jesse, I think he just lost it. Magnus, crack the cannon! Yeah! Finish it with a cannon! If it's a cannon you want, it's a cannon you'll get! Yep, he's completely lost it. Dude's going for the kill. Jesse, you'd better craft the, I don't know, greatest thing of your life? Like right now! Well, there's still some material in the chest. That's it, Jesse, go! Axel, check it out. Ha! That should hold him. Yeah, it's, yeah, um, yeah, it might do, but Jesse, look. Whoa! <laughs> we were supposed to throw the fight. <laughs> Jesse, look out! <laughs> against the king of the creepers and you pick stone ha get off no pigs allowed stop i got cool stuff coming your way i got you an arrow for your bow i think it's enchanted or a bow in a cannon fight actually there are all sorts of cliched lines about this yeah but the tnt inside the cannon tnt plus arrow Oh, yeah. Time to see how well you fly, pig. Ruben! Boom! I got you, I got you. Man, you smell delicious right now. Hey, Magnus! Yeah? Short stuff? Flying pig jokes are totally played out. <laughs>
gonna say something there, champ? It's just the winner sometimes, I don't know, gives a speech. People of Boomtown, bow before your new ruler. You may grumble, you may groan, but I'm in charge now. Welp, you guys ready then? Oh, yeah! This'll be a way easier target than Magnus. Wait, what's going on? Oh, well, that's not good. Holy crap! Is that your wither storm? How are we? What are we? That's... Ah! Oh, no. Oh, no! No! No, 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 no! Stop eating my kid! Magnus, come on! You'll regret messing with Boomtown! Go! Okay, just a little farther. Wow! Someone really went bonkers with the defenses, huh? <laughs> oh! Who goes there? Oh, Jesse? Is that you? Lucas, did you build all of this? Well, yeah. I, I figured I would try and fortify the place, you know? Nice! I'm so glad you're back! And we brought Magnus! Fantastic! Quick, come on! You guys are never gonna believe who showed up while you were gone. Gabriel! Hello, everyone. It is good to see you. He showed up not too long before you guys. Magnus, my old you friend. You always were a tough cookie to keep down. Ha <laughs> ha! See you. It's good to see you too, you old meathead. Oh, and it's especially good to see you, Jesse. I fear that you might be the last face I ever saw. I don't understand. How did you escape? If you hadn't pulled me out of the Witherstorm's clutches, well, let's just not think about that. I came here to the temple, hoping against hope to find other survivors. It makes me glad that. Even in these terrible times, this temple can stand as a stronghold, a symbol. Wow, did Petra get away too? Did you see? All that creature left in its wake was bedrock. All those people. Your friend Petra. No one could get away. We are alive. That means there's still hope. Come along. Everyone else is still inside. Wow! Been a while since I've been here. Whoa. What is she doing here? Oh, well, this isn't going to go well. Right. Um, I forgot to mention... Olivia went on a little expedition of her own while you were gone. And this Olivia person came back with her? Did you know about this? Did Eligard put you up to this? You think you know a guy, and then bam. Olivia's a friend of mine. I didn't know that she was going off to recruit Eligard. Magnus, you gotta believe me. Well, I certainly don't have anything to say to her. Jesse, Jesse! Look! I found Eligard! Just hang on a sec, okay? I'll go figure out what's going on. Good. You do that. Easy now, Olivia. Let's try and play it cool. Hmm? So, who are you now? And why did you bring him with you? Yeah, and you two are going to have to get along, okay? We didn't even know you were gonna be here. If he's nice, I'll be nice too. 
It was kind of crazy, actually. I went to Redstonia, and there were all these incredible engineers and inventors. It was a little intimidating, actually, but Elagard's made me her protege. Well, assistant for now. I mean, after what happened. I know, I'm sorry. So sorry. I tried to break into Elagard's private chambers to get her help, and maybe, uh, the less said the better, okay? She might have, well, embarrassed herself. A tiny bit. Yeah. But after I pled my case, she agreed to take me on as her assistant and come back to help. Not bad, right? Oh, hooray! It's Ellie. And here I was just starting to enjoy myself. Hello, Magnus. Your voice is exactly as pleasant as I remember. Which is to say, not at all. Oh, my feelings. Is that the same wit you're gonna use to save the world? Why? You here to tell me how to do it better? Oh, I would never dream of doing that. Unlike you, I actually do things instead of just talking about them. Hey, that's Eligard you're talking to. Show her some respect. Wow, you finally found yourself a live one. Hey! Your little devotees are usually a little more on the bookish side. Would you all cut it out? Holy crap, you're all acting like crazy people. Uh, people, can we please focus on the bigger picture? We have a very hungry Witherstorm in the process of turning the whole world into its dinner. Yeah, I'll admit, that thing looked real nasty. And I've seen some nasty stuff in my time. Too much for you, was it? Your usual brutish approach didn't cut it? Hey, you weren't there, all right? You didn't see how this thing just tore everything up. You've never seen anything like it. Would you two stop fighting? Whoa! Yikes. Jesse speaks the truth. We must find a way to defeat that monstrosity. I don't know if you've looked around yet, but this place isn't nearly the stronghold it used to be. Most of our supplies are gone. It would take a mountain of TNT to kill that thing. I hate to say it, but you have a point. This is amazing. I know. Can we start crafting some then? I don't think we got that kind of time. But even if we had all the TNT for miles around, I don't know if it would be enough. If only Soren were here, he might have something we could use. Oh, Ellie, not this again. Wait, Magnus. She may have a point. Soren did have certain objects, inventions. You know I hate when you brag about you and Soren's little brainy club. I'm not bragging. I think I've got a legitimate idea here. There's something stronger than TNT? Soren had a kind of super TNT. Stronger and more explosive than anything else in the world. The Formida Bomb. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've heard all about the F Bomb before. F Bomb? Yeah. Soren claimed that dropping the F Bomb could destroy anything. Well, the Formida Bomb sounds perfect. We should go get it now. Well, there's a little problem there. We don't know where Soren is, but you found Magnus and Eligard. Do you know where he is? Our map could locate him. Unless he's in the Nether, or the End. But it's worth a shot. I bet we can find him. light. That's new. There he is. Soren had his fortress deep inside the mountains. After the order broke up, that's where he went to keep doing his experiments. Look, he invited me there a couple times, but it always seemed a little weird, right? It always seemed a little weird. Glad we can agree on that at any rate. But let's stop hanging around here and go get us some super TNT. Whoa. It 
didn't do that before. Are you sure it's working? Blue? Blue? That's Ivor! Ivor is going to Soren's. We need to move! It's not too far. We could probably make it on foot. Perfect. We can wait till tomorrow morning and travel with a full day's sunlight. Uh, and risk that thing catching up with us? I think I've had enough wither storm for one day. Uh, thank you very much. Right, because getting caught out there in the dark is so much better. Trust me, if you had seen this thing, you wouldn't want to stick around. Yeah, I don't want the wither storm catching up with us. We should go now. Jesse here's talking a lot of sense. Let's just go with that plan. You're just saying that because it's your plan, but fine. Okay, everyone, let's get moving. Jesse, right? Oh, hello. We haven't had the chance to acquaint ourselves properly. According to Gabriel, you saved him from this wither storm. Sounds like you're a pretty impressive individual. Picks fights with lots of monsters? I'm just doing my best to keep everyone safe. I can always appreciate humility. I like you. In any case... I sort of wish that you had taken my side earlier, but water under the bridge and all that. A slight tangent, what's the uh, deal with your friend Olivia? I appreciate her enthusiasm, but she can be a little much sometimes. She's always very eager to jump in and help, which is sweet, of course, though sometimes I wish she would think a bit more before jumping in. She can be kind of a know-it-all sometimes. That's tough. I suppose I could see that. Though I've mostly just gotten her, uh, sucking up side. Would you say that's why you didn't listen to her plan to come recruit me? Not to make it awkward or anything. Or to demand, why didn't you want to recruit me? <laughs> just curiosity. I figured that we needed firepower, and no one knows destruction better than Magnus. The man does know how to blow things up with reckless abandon, that's for sure. I'll do my best to not let it hurt my feelings. <laughs> joke. That was a joke. Yep, exactly what I worried about, and exactly why we should have waited till morning. At least the wither storm isn't tearing us apart right now, all right? We can hash all that out later, because we got some monsters to fight here, people. Daytime. How far is Zorin? It can't be much further. Not much farther. We can make it. isn't it? <coughs> yeah, and I'm really not feeling those columns. Ah, oh, come on! It's fine! Look! Woo! <coughs> uh. 
Don't fall, okay? Oh, that is deep. That is very, very deep. thought I would come down to help. <laughs> Endermen. There are so many. I didn't think they ever came in groups that big. Thanks for coming back, Lucas. I mean that. walks away. That's it! I'm going! See? I'm walking away too now! Super TNT! Here I come! It's hard to pick glass half full when they keep kicking the glass over. And I thought they were doing so well. Yeah, I wouldn't go that far. Pickering is kind of their deal. But hopefully they'll work things out and get on with the important stuff. What are we gonna do now? Where should we go? Figure it out. Gabriel, are you okay? I know it's not the best time, and I, I don't want to worry. But there's something I'd like to discuss with you in private, Jesse. But let's split up. Whoa. I'm aware that letting them head off alone was risky, but I need to talk to you about a private matter. It's not the easiest thing to bring up. Hey, whatever it is, I trust you. You can tell me. Thank you for being so understanding. I'm so glad to see my old friends together again. I don't want to ruin it with this. What? You may have succeeded in getting me away from the Witherstorm, but I fear it was already too late. I noticed it not long after you saved me. What is that? What's wrong with your arm? Tell me. Do you know what Wither is? The Wither? Of course, we've been- No, just Wither. Or Wither Sickness, to be more descriptive. It is something I've contracted before in my travels. But it always wears off. It seems that Ivor's monster exudes a Wither Sickness that is decidedly more... fatal. Well, we're gonna go back and tell the others we can get help. No, Jesse. You can't tell anyone about this. Ah! <sighs> Creeper! Look out! <laughs> Take my head! I'll pull you up! <laughs> my strength has 
compromised. I couldn't maintain my hold. I'm so sorry. Jesse, are you all right? Don't worry, I'm fine. Time to be a hero again. Stay safe. I'll find a way down to you. Must have something useful in here. He has to. Hey, show yourself. Who's there? <gasps> you. Trying to interfere with my plans again, I see. Your tenacity is commendable, yet misguided. Ivor, just calm down, okay? I think we're here for the same reason. I'm here with the order to find Soren's Super TNT. We're gonna take down your Witherstorm. The order? <laughs> Believe me. That plan will blow up in their faces in more ways than one. They cannot help you. But me? I choose not to. Out of my way. Sorry, Ivor. I'm... Stop right there, Ivor! <laughs> Gabriel! You're alive! Against all your best efforts, Ivor. Look at what you've done. I never dreamt that even you could be this twisted. Save your posturing, Gabriel. We both have your words have always been hollow, just like the Order. You're not going anywhere, Ivor. At least not in one piece. I'm not letting him leave either. I'm the only one who can stop the Witherstorm! Not you, not the Order! Don't make yourselves the villains in my story. <laughs> Stay and fight, you coward! This could have all been avoided. If you want to stop me, you'll have to catch me first! Look out, Izzy! He's using a potion of swiftness! We mustn't let him escape! Uh, I'm like the wind! Jesse, you could have just let me go. <laughs> now you see me. Now you. <laughs> it's one of his invisibility potions. He could be anywhere. 
invisible or not, he isn't going to get by me. useless babblers never cease? What's going on? You found Ivor. Stopped him. Hmm. False. You have stopped nothing. A query. Have you ever seen the effects of a splash potion of slowness? That they can destroy the Wither Storm? But they are mistaken. And it will cost them their lives. Next time on Minecraft Story Mode. In pursuit of answers, all our heroes found in Sauron's armory was deceit and treachery. Locked in a dark chamber deep in Zoran's mountain, as the Order of the Stone rides off towards near certain doom, our heroes must ask themselves, would they find a way out of this dark tomb? Is there any way to cure Gabriel's wither sickness? Would they find a way to defeat the wither storm? Or would they remain trapped as it continues its ravenous rampage across the entire world? Only time will tell.